Oh, welcome back to Rob's Homemade. Hope you are all well. Hope you are continuing to get through this stupidity and what's going on in the world. It's a sad state of affairs at the moment. But hopefully I can bring a bit of joy in the next five, six minutes when you sit back, relax, enjoy your evening, whatever you're doing, and watch a bit of Rob's Homemade and hopefully Give you some bit of inspiration of what you can buy, what's out there in the shops. We went shopping at our local Aldi's. Yes, local Aldi store. You could probably get this anywhere to be perfectly honest, but this is where I saw it. It's Mossa Rotha Private Chocolatiers Mousse au Chocolat. Mousse au Chocolat. Au Chocolat. Bit of it posh. Um, sour cherry and chili, 85% cocoa. There we go. I did do Mossa Rotha um, chili chocolate before. It was quite a while ago, it was a fair few months ago. But I've seen this one with a sour cherry and it sounds really nice. It's a fair trade product, so all good there. Um, rich dark, 85% chocolate combines perfectly with lightly whipped chocolate mousse and spicy sour cherry chili. Spicy sour cherry, cherry chili filling. Say, try saying that three times fast, I bet you call. Spicy sour cherry chili, spicy sour cherry chili, spicy cherry cherry chili. Well, there you go. Uh, it's great, an unforgettable taste and says, four individually wrapped bars of dark chocolate with lightly whipped chocolate mousse and sour cherry filling. Ingredients. Sorry guys, glass is tight. We have dark chocolate, cocoa mass, cocoa butter, sugar, fat reduced cocoa powder, emulsifier, vanilla extract, glucose, buttermilk, butter fat milk, sorry, concentrated cherry juice, 3.5%, um, cocoa butter, Mars, Mars, maize starch, natural flavorings, plant extract, black carrot concentrate, black carrot concentrate wow oh well and it just says chili extract super for vegetarians no artificial flavorings this pack contains four but this actually was sorry i lied specially produced for aldi stores so maybe this is the only place you can get muscle broth of these days i don't know maybe maybe not anyway what i do like about muscle broth is their packaging. It looks really nice. And then you've got the flap at the back to open the box. And there's four individually wrapped. So when you've got a big bar of chocolate like that, it's normally in foil, and you, and you have to wrap it back up and all that garbage that goes with it. But these are perfect. I mean, look. Let's see if I can hold them in without dropping them. Four individually wrapped. That's perfect. That's perfect packaging. Not for a chocoholic, they'd probably sit in it all four anyway. But for me, that's perfect because I'll go one for me, one for you, one for whoever. So, yeah, I, that's 10 out of 10 for the packaging. I love it. And even the individually wrapped ones, it's got the allergy advice on it. But even the individually wrapped ones have got the moss, not, they're not just plain packaging them well put together first thing though i'm not a massive massive dark chocolate fan as you all know i'm more of a savory kind of guy i like my sweets uh, my crisps my uh, pringles <clears throat> my peanuts my popcorn stuff that i prefer to chocolate but if it's got chili in it who knows I might be converted. And even the individual bars broken into four. Awesome. So you can just take what you want. So here we are. It's even got the Mossarotha stamp on it. These are well made. You know them well. When people put the effort into the packaging like that, you know it's going to be decent. Mmm. The inside, I don't know if you can really see this on camera. But it's like a mousse, cherry mousse. I was expecting a hard chocolate all the way through. Mm. 
a good very very good quality chocolate the cherry flavor <coughs> is bang on absolutely bang on like i said i'm not a chocolate fan but this is good mm. just melts away and you keep getting little bursts of cherry every now and again so good that's really really good so tasty i'll definitely be eating this the four pieces unfortunately the reason i bought it is because it had chili on the front no nah. no chili at all no heat no nothing which is disappointing but the flavor of that chocolate i've got to give it a nine i've got to give it a nine because it's beautiful it's so so tasty and so nice and the burst of cherry every now and again in your mouth are awesome if i had a bit of heat to it i'd get them 100% would get a 10 from Rob it's smooth it's not as bitter as most dark chocolates I've had before I do love I do like white chocolate I mean, in fact I do love white chocolate if I'm going to eat chocolate it's normally white mm. But yeah, Mossa Rotha Mousse au Chocolat gets a 9, would be a 10 if that chilli made an appearance, but unfortunately it doesn't, it makes no appearance at all, which is very very disappointing, but flavour wise you can't knock it, that is really good really really good chocolate so it gets a nine from me 100 percent like i said it would get a 10 if that chili had even the tiniest tiniest bit of heat so if i'm shopping in out there see mozzarotha sour cherry and chili get some it's lovely it's absolutely beautiful beautiful chocolate so i just want to say thank you very much for watching Hope you enjoyed this video and if you do like your chocolate and you like your cherry flavour, you won't be disappointed in Mozzarotha. Mousse au chocolate. So once again, thank you very much for watching. Smash that like button, hit that subscribe button and I will be back very, very soon. Peace!